And here he is, walking down the people's aisle, getting in the people's ring, weighing in, what? 210 pounds from, you know it, Manchester, England, the game planning, Rick the Rock. And that's right, I am Rick the Rock, and welcome to the one, the only, the big, the bold, the people's WWE channel. We are on the road to the event that is the epic wrestle mania. And you guys know what to do. Follow me on Twitter at Rick the Rock Pay and send me a tweet. Hashtag Rick the Rock. Tell your friend, all your friends about Rick the Rock. Share this video all over the people's internet. Add me on Facebook, Richard J. Pay, and send me a message. For, comment below. Check out all my other videos, such as my SmackDown review. Make sure to like and subscribe. Team Bring It Worldwide. Go and view and like my Facebook page, the People's WE page, Team Bring It. Check out the videos and pictures on there. And also check out WWN, World Wrestling Network, on Facebook. I'm a brand new Alice, to, Alice 4, tell them I sent you. But this is how I would book this week's WWE Smackdown. So there was Pyro, so this was good. Like I said, I think there should be Pyro on Raw and SmackDown every single week. Sasha Banks beat Charlotte um, by pinfall, or they've had Charlotte, Sasha Banks winning either by DQ or count out. Um, I just think that this loss to WrestleMania, everybody really needs momentum heading into WrestleMania. Um, next week, SmackDown is live. I do hope that's a proper SmackDown, proper matches, because uh, that's a, their last chance to hype WrestleMania. Um, it was singles action. She Sheamus beat Kofi Kingston. Uh, this week match, decent, it was a good match, but he went on a bit too long. So, a much needed win for Sheamus here, but I would have just cut down the time of that match. The Usos beat The Ascension in a very quick win. Uh, this is a problem the Ascension losing all the time on Superstars on main event because when they're in a proper match against me like the Usos There's gonna be no chance of they're gonna win. So that's the problem with burying talent really In a fresh match, and I, I love fresh matches. Sami Zayn and Dolph Ziggler beat Kimmy Owens and The Miz um, The only thing I would have changed here is I would have had Sami Zayn pinning Kimmy Owens to carry on their rivalry in another fresh match, Bubba Ray Dudley beat Roman Reigns by DQ. I would have had Roman Reigns winning. Um, it, it was nine days away from Mania, and he's losing. Roman Reigns is losing to Bubba Ray Dudley. Uh, AJ Styles beat Tyler Breeze. Again, Tyler Breeze is another guy that recently has been losing on Superstars and main events is that rider. A guy that's been pushed back. A guy that's been buried. Um, so... Um, AJ Styles could really, really, really took on somebody else that maybe had a chance of beating him. And great way to end SmackDown, Brock Lesnar, the Beast Incarnate, the Conqueror, and Paul Heyman came out, Paul talked, the White family came out, Brock suplexed both Eric Rowan and Braun Strowman, which that was really good. Um, and then Dean Ambrose came out and Brock a 5 him. Great way to hype their match for WrestleMania, but I would just wouldn't have had the White family coming out because as of late, the White family is getting pushed back and pushed back and pushed back. So that's what I would how, how I would have put SmackDown. Let me know in the comments below if you agree. What are you looking forward to at WrestleMania? Comment, like, subscribe, and follow. If you smell the rock.